bought that many potions. First of all, now you can't collect any from the enemies. But they don't drop like any. Yeah, but like between now and the end of the game. I've been using potions on the island though. Alright. But don't blame me when you end up with 99 potions per... Oh god, you have no money left. I'm so and sad. Do not give a single shit. <laughs> Woohoo! I give zero shits. Collectively. You could lean this way rather than that way, and then you'd be near the microphone. <laughs> and sitting up straight. And everything would be better, and we, the children wouldn't cry anymore. That's fine, the floating contract. You know, you know, as somebody now that has kids, I have to say, when you watch a, a show or a movie, and the, the big plot line is, uh, you know, uh, a kid, a child has cried, so, like... You know, like this is a big disaster. Yeah. I realize what, like, well, how full of shit that is. And there's all these books out there that are aimed at t parents that tell them, like, you know, like, like, oh, here's how you should may as well save because it's just it'd be convenient in case you just die in the next move. Yeah. Okay, good. He's always uh, still crouching and everything. Um. Uh. He's wearing one of my uh, least favorite uh, TV series from uh, the '90s. Um. You mean uh, his weird mutant melted face? No, it blossom. Um, <laughs> whoa! Um, there's a Blossom reference for you. Um, I'm wearing a kicky hat. Um, yeah. but anyway, uh... Because he's a ninja? Well, but, like, they have there's all these books on, like, there's the no-cry-sleep solution, which I've, we've had with both our boys. Yeah. And it's certainly a good idea to respond to them when they cry at night, like if it's a little baby, um, and to try and reduce their crying. And you can do stuff to train them to sleep so you don't have to, like, do just the cry-to-sleep method. Yeah. You know, you can use other methods of, um... Um, oh, do we have the ability to control, or is that something you get later? That's that's later. That's with a special item that you get after uh, plot points. That for some reason we were avoiding. Spoiling. So then now sketch has no purpose in terms of the purpose we were aiming for. No, because if he uses the ability that he can learn. Okay, can, you can decide that you can choose the target. No, because it doesn't have to be hit by it. It has to be some. He has to see it. Oh, is that all? Yeah, I believe oh. so. Mm -hmm. So you've got a slightly higher chance of, ma of making the uh, thing. They're a great team, eventually. Yeah. Right now they're useless. You know, there is a Velt in the future, so it, we should you should probably head for the boss, and we'll do our best to get that skill. So you made me get a stupid useless party. Oh, hey, dragon. Dragons are useful. I'm going to sketch it. <laughs> what are you revenging against, dragon? What are you, what's your problem? What a useless entire battle. <laughs> There's nothing. I will attack you, being the most powerful ancient dragon from your realms. I will attack you with all the damage you have so far wrecked upon me and my kind. Zero damage. Oh yeah? You want to show, see what real power is? I will use that very power against you. Zero damage. Oh yeah, let's get counterattacks with sneeze. Well, welcome to suplexing the dragon 64. Now if he dies, you survive, right? Or no? Do you get game over? What? If he, if you it, if you if he dies, do you just kick? kick oh, out okay. The I thought you meant if the dragon dies. Yeah, if the dragon if dies, die, do the, I get battle, game over? the battle continues <laughs> indefinitely. If you if the dragon dies, what, one, yay! One of the riders is going to be um, Tyrion. But anyway, there's all this stuff about like no cry sleep solution, and we used it, and we think it's good overall. But this idea that if you don't, that if you let your child child cry, that you're a bad parent, or like you know you you, you the, you're the, just an aunt, you know like you're not really providing a correct care. Like the truth is, babies and children cry a lot. It's their, especially at, up until like a year and a half. It's their only means of communication. Yeah, they can't communicate any other way. So if they're not crying, they're actually dead. Yeah, like if they if you have a child that doesn't cry for a really long time, either they have like maybe they're selfish. Maybe they're uh, deaf, or like maybe they have like some sort of disability. Those are the excuses why why a child wouldn't cry for like large portions of time. Yeah. But if they don't cry for like, it, yeah, it, basically, you need a child to cry. It's just it's, yeah. yeah. It's not like it's fun. It's just they're gonna cry. I think and, it's fun. And we tried the 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 no cry sleep solution, and it's great for a while. But after a while, you you eventually turn to okay. Well, the child has to be able to put themselves down in their own bed for a while, and so you're gonna have to like. You know, except that there's going to be a little bit of crying if they don't want to be in bed, yeah. and it's their bedtime and they're very tired, or or they even they just fall down for all we know, you know. Yeah. Um. The. 
that uh, really slowed everything down. Yeah, and that one always does for some reason. I think those are the animations made up of individual objects or something. Yeah, they are. Which is dumb. Uh, <sighs> poor programming. But, um... Basically, like, yeah, I don't like it when my child cries. I mean, unless the child deserves it, obviously. Yeah. But uh, I think Life Shaver... I think you shouldn't do one of those guys because they can, um... You, they can use this Life Shaver on the undead, and I think you would get damage from that. Maybe. I can't have something weird about it. I'm also glad that the, the sketch glitch doesn't exist in this version of the game. Yeah. Because that was, like, The balls. worst thing. The worst thing ever. But anyway, I just think that, like... And if a child is crying behind you on an airplane, be thankful they're not crying for the entire flight. That's what I have to say. Like, like our children... Neither of our children have really done much crying on our, on our on flights. We've taken our kids on flights because we have to get from one place to another that's too far to drive. We're going to fly. And we've been lucky enough that our kids have not cried very much on the plane. Like, maybe... Uh, I was hoping you would heal yourself. Well, I guess you weren't but badly damaged. Um, maybe like... Um, oh, that's weird. Um, I don't even know if that's going to show up. My, my new son, my younger son, he would tend to cry at the end of the flight, like at the very end of the flight. Like when you're about to get off, yeah. he would kind of wake up from like being fed or whatever and like... I think that does that, percentage damage, I believe. I think that's actually a technique that you want to copy, actually. I don't think we've seen it yet. Have no, we? I don't think so. Or maybe it's not. There's a few of text techniques that I always thought should have been. Apparently there was going to be a wind element in this game, but they never got around to finishing programming it, so there was no... Uh, that explains how there's arrow that does nothing. Yeah, it was going to be like a full element, just like fire, water, or whatever else like that. Yeah. They just didn't get far, far enough into it. They had to, they basically, this game's unfinished, and it it's is. garbage. Uh, uh, zero out of ten. Uh, oh, you know what? Typical... Game of the year. It's, it's, it's typical of just like this whole DLC thing where like they give a broken game, yeah. it's incomplete, and... And then expect models to fix it. 